So there's these anti-gravitational super propulsion systems that can travel from space to our atmosphere into the water super fast, and we don't know what it is, but we can't talk about it. Anyway, today's Oddball video is sponsored by Space Taco. Greetings, Earthlings. It's Shane with Oddball Cards, Random Space Debris, Olive Loaf, Bo Tecmo. All right, it is Sunday morning. That means it's time for coffee, time travel, and baseball cards with Oddball. This little box here, you know, I told you I just couldn't get enough of 2022 Heritage. And after about uh, almost two weeks, it arrived to me. My PayPal is uh, connected to my P.O. box, which I use. And... Uh, this little baby took a little trip because it was sent FedEx. Usually the buyer will send me a, a note or something. Uh, I even paid with Apple Pay so that maybe they had my street address. But anyway, uh, it's right on time for you and I. All right. This episode is brought to you by uh, Diamond Princess's 1,000 variety of beef jerky and ice cream. Congrats to you on a thousand subs, well deserved. Uh, our league leaders, a couple weeks into the season, here's Freddie Galvis. Patrick Corbin was underrated, and now he's on a god awful team. Luis Robert and Tristan McKenzie, a couple of my favorite players to watch, monitor, read the box scores on. Tim Anderson is a fun player. Second year card of Jazz. Look at all these inserts. And someone I have accidentally put on the DL. Hopefully he's coming back soon. Shout out to Lisa Dankavich. Matt Manning of the Tigers. All right. Our home run leaders are little Anthony Rizzo. And should have drafted him in fantasy. I knew it right as it was too late. CJ Cron. I think I got that right. I know his last name's Cron. Byron Buxton. And Aaron Judge tied at nine. Below that are Willie Adamas, if you can believe that. And one of my favorite players, Jordan Alvarez. Shout out to CC, the Cuban collector. He collects Cuban players, and he's Cuban. So just so you don't think I'm making fun. Avid collector, longtime supporter of the Oddball Chronicles. All right, Glaber Torres, shout out to Lord73. Shohei Otani can pitch. His hitting's coming around. I forgot to check both of these for high numbers. Our, let's see, I have broken Andrew Vaughn. It is official. And Logan Gilbert for the Mariners. If you uh, are busy with new kids or something to that effect and don't have time to read all the box scores, Logan Gilbert has had six starts. And a 1.36 ERA. High numbers are 401 plus. We do not have any. That first pack had 1 million inserts, so I didn't think so. All right. Uh, let's see. Also, let's check in on a spotlight on the Minnesota Twins. I am the proud owner and proprietor of the Gary Sanchez bandwagon. I'm sad to report he is hitting 209. The, uh, the, did I see Mariners? I meant Minnesota Twins. Duh. Uh, let's put that here. That's Lord 79's favorite player, Joey Gallo. Here's a Yu Chang, Harrison Bader, Alex Dickerson, David Fletcher. Uh, let's see. The, the Twins called up Royce Lewis. Our batting leaders are Manny Machado, Taylor Ward. I don't think any of us uh, saw that coming. Hosmer, another uh, Padre. Ben Attendee and Josh Bell, and I'm sure none of you had them in that order on your bingo card. Ronald Acuna Jr. is back, and I didn't get to watch the video, but everyone needs to tell me. I think Yu Chang is not a high number because I think it starts at 401. That he hit one and then fell down or something, and no one was making fun of it like a super blooper or something like that. Hey, I'm rhyming. All right. Hedgehog came up to me this week, and I was ready for the quips and qualms and the criticism. And he said, looks like you had a good week and so had some ac positive accomplishments. Get some coffee here. My first cup of coffee is a hot coffee. 
but I'm far too sleepy to hang out with you guys during my first cup of coffee. Sometime I'll do it just so you hear how silly I sound. I sound like I haven't slept in like three days. I said, do you have a fever? Usually you're uh, rude, sarcastic, biting, and kind of hurts my feelings. Jake the Rake, I hope I don't break him. He's my fantasy guy. Bobby Bradley, shout out to Haas the Boss, Bo Tecmo. Hey, I wasn't sure if they put the, that's nice to know, they put the SPs backwards in, this is a retail box, a fresh one. We can't cover up, we'll cover up Bosque. May the 4th was several days ago. And there's an insert in with the short print, huh? My rule of thumb was always you don't get a short print if you have an insert. Well, I'm glad I was looking, and I'm glad that they dummy-proofed it for Oddball. Uh, and Hedgehog said to me, you heard the question, Mac. Tell me about some positive accomplishments. Looks like you have some. I said, well, man, have this awesome playlist. Has some new Jerry Cantrell. Stumbled on some Liam Gallagher. Uh, it's consistent with some drum beats I've been learning and drum lessons. Had some Slipknot, Tool, Crystal Method, Mastodon. He said your Chipotle numbers look pretty good. That's good. We've had fewer coworker complaints about you. Looks like the subliminal messages while you sleep are working. I said, damn it, Hedgehog, just when I thought you were human. Subliminal messages while I'm sleeping. I never. All right, Will Myers. I was a big fan of him when I first started collecting in one of the Walmart boxes. Did I say Walmart? Walgreens. Oh, gosh. L to speak, oddball. Walgreens boxes. I got his autograph, and I had liked him. He was on Tampa Bay. Colton Wong. Looks like he's such a good fit for the Brewers. Hey, there's my guy. Owner, proprietor of the Gary Sanchez bandwagon. Zach Gallon. Wish I'd drafted him in fantasy. Even though he's on a bad team, a double clutch. And Joey Votto, shout out to the Reds fans in my life. Jeff Ruoff, John Klinsman, the manager Terry who had to reschedule long-suffering Reds fan. Oh, that's right. The uh, short prints are turned around backwards. All right. Uh, let's see. I had this nice rant prepared because Bowman is $32. And I was thinking to myself... They got me right at the price point to uh, try to get my monies back, and it's hard to enjoy it. But then, uh, if you are not subscribed to Gourmet Breaks, excellent channel. Uh, do be warned, I do hang out there on Saturdays and Tuesdays if you've had enough of me or can't stand me. Hopefully, you've hit the back button and found something better to do by now. But um, opened a box of Bowman on the channel with the guys, had a blast got the chase card really had some fun so it really ruined my bowman rant i had prepared i even had a nice slipknot uh lyrics that i really uh i'm worried with fanatics i won't lie to you tyler o'neill oh there's one of my favorite things a gold cup card of a player i collect yandy diaz matt chapman logan webb austin slater all right i guess i don't have to turn these around i'm gonna have a little faith that they're uh Facing correctly, the, the Slipknot quote I had just to wow everybody and get everybody on the edge of their seats. I will not celebrate mediocrity. Sometimes Top's flagship is feeling mediocre. Uh, I will not worship empty shells. I will not listen to worthless noises. I will not subject myself to selected, predictable choices. My time, my attention should not be bought and sold for convenience's sake, ever. All right, that's still how I feel about the hobby. We're right on that edge. We're either getting kind of watered down versions of baseball, I'm sorry, basketball or football. The good baseball stuff is snatched up, but uh, there's a lot of good folks out there. Gourmet, uh, I'm a big fan of BMAX breaks. There are great places to hang out. Thank goodness for uh, people like that that get products and pass it along to people at reasonable prices. Shout out to you guys, Jake Fraley. My buddy uh, Ripping for Ripkins is now mining for Mondeses. He's a big Jake Fraley collector, as is Hedgehog, actually. Zach Grenke, here's another uh, SP. I had to have somebody tell me, I think it might have been Hedgehog or Farm League, that uh, those short prints are not always superstar players because it follows a kind of a time 
tried and true time worn tradition. There we go. I can almost talk. All right. This episode is brought to you by Scrap Metal and Mayhem's Heated Camping Toilets. It's also brought to you by Lance and the Booty Shakers, who have two singles out there right now. They are a nice cover of Street Fighting Man and an original song of theirs, 52 Times Around the Sun. Also brought to you by Farm League's Minor League Braves Pipeline Podcast. All right. Uh, I caught the guys joyriding in my time machine. Uh, as you can expect, David Pert had chocolate on his face, smelled like Taco Bell. Yeah, he's a miscellaneous rookie. We haven't gotten a ton of those. Carson Kelly, uh, both Hedgehog and David Pert had some vintage 1980s I'm with stupid shirts and kept standing next to me, so the arrow pointed out at me. I am going to. I do like to talk fantasy. Uh... This is from Paul C., my good friend. I believe this egg is a gift. It was, uh, is and was a symbol of my channel. Uh, Hedgehog came to me and said, I got this ant farm on Rygar 6. That makes it an alien ant farm oddball. I was like, dude, that, okay, that's clever. That's kind of funny. Uh, David said, we went to the 1978 to the Derwiner Schnitzel. Uh, I had to do some deep diving. I remember as a kid, it's still open and it's just called Wiener Schnitzel, but people call it Der Wiener Schnitzel because it's so silly. I like silly things. Angry old man was there. He was wearing a zoot suit. Don't know why. He said, oddball, we went to the Sex Pistols' last concert in San Francisco. It's like, that is awesome. Hedgehog said, we sold the Der Wiener Schnitzel. At the Super Bowl in 78, when your cowgirls beat the Orange Orange Crush Broncos. I was actually living in Boulder at that time, and sadly, I am a Cowboys fan. All right. David said we were in the first studio audience of, not Dansby Swanson. We hate Dansby Swanson, but we love to hate Dansby Swanson. Uh, in the first episode of Dallas... We were with Big Chief, Card Wolf, and Craig B. Hey, there's a Randy Arazarena gold cup. Just fun little kitschy. Another gold cup. Not one. Of, not someone I collect. I do collect Randy. And a short print of Kim. All right. Now we're getting somewhere. My favorite guy. He's not doing well. Won't lie to you. Jason Hayward with that big contract. Uh, and Hedgehog said, basically, we had a blast without you, Oddball. You've been thunderstruck. And David Pert said, move your butt, shake your butt, wash your butt, shake your butt. Oh, there we go. Wouldn't be a party if Oddball didn't knock the camera. That's for you, Chris. It was an accident. And Kurt. Want to thank uh, Mrs. Oddball, Haas, I call him Bo Tecmo, Paul C. And out there, please have a happy Mother's Day. As always, Oddball out. Testing, test, 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 test.